that's here's um here's the globe on the on the right here. This is Buenos Aires, big city, and here's Cape Town, big uh, big travel spot. Four thousand two hundred seventy six miles um, on the globe. This is how a plane should fly, and it should take uh, maybe nine hours. If the plane's going five hundred miles an hour, it should take less than nine hours, but it doesn't. They go all the way up to the north, and then all the way back down, and it takes twenty nine hours. Okay, because we're not right here. If you have to go on the globe, you have to go all the way up here, and then all the way back down. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. It makes it makes no sense whatsoever. So, if you wanted to go from Buenos Aires, major city, to Perth, major city, plenty of people want to fly. They can fill an airplane. No need to go pick up people in North America. This would be the fastest trail. But what's wrong with this trail? We could disturb the migrational path of the penguins. The penguins. By flying an airplane at 45,000 feet over Antarctica where the penguins couldn't hear it or see it. Okay? So so the shortest route would be, the next route would be you can go around either side of Antarctica, right? That way you won't disturb, you won't disturb the penguins. Right. The emperor right. penguins, please. Okay? So, But the real route these planes take is this. They go from here, from... Uh, Buenos Aires, they either stop in Miami or Houston, then they stop again in Los Angeles, then they go to Sydney, and then they go to Perth. Or they go the other way to uh, Europe, Singapore, and Perth. It takes like 26 hours for that flight. Why don't they just cut three quarters of that distance off and cut across the bottom? NASA is in charge of all the plane routes. They're in charge of all the world GPS Right, they're they're controlling the lie, right? And they have sophisticated programs. I'll, um, I used to say most pilots don't know, but most pilots do know the Earth is flat. They just don't talk about it because they get fired if they do. Here's the book. This book is an amazing book. You can buy it on Lulu. It's like a coffee table book. If you want to, I think it's like 40 bucks or something. I have the color version. It's amazing. But it's also free online. You can download the PDF. And there's 16 landings that, that he documented that make zero sense on a Glober. Mm-hmm.